It was a case that shocked even investigators. A woman overdoses while seven months pregnant. The baby was delivered early and will likely have some health struggles. But now a local judge has thrown out the most serious charge against her. Amy Wattis explains. 30-year-old Casey Dishman was charged in June with felony aggravated assault of an unborn child. State police say Dishman was found on the bathroom floor of her East Butler apartment overdosed on opiates. Paramedics rushed her to the hospital where she went into cardiac arrest. The next day, doctors performed a C-section to deliver a female baby. But her attorney argued that Dishman is protected from the aggravated assault charge by a clause in the law that exempts pregnant women from prosecution for crimes against their unborn children. As I indicated to the court, this is a very slippery slope for um, you know all pregnant women. There are um, drug addicted babies born every day, and if this charge applies, it may apply across the board, depending on how this or the child would be addicted. In today's ruling, Butler Common Pleas Judge William Schaefer agreed, writing that while, quote, the defendant is alleged to have done a senseless, selfish, and heinous act that allegedly resulted in devastating and permanent injuries to her unborn child, this court is nonetheless constrained. Judge Schaefer dismissed the felony aggravated assault charge, but lesser charges of child endangerment, corruption of a minor, and drug possession will proceed. This case is a tragedy. It is a tragedy for uh, everybody involved, the baby, Casey Dishman, the family, and um, but there is a limit to where the criminal law can go. Amy Wattis, KDKA TV News.